Hello gamers and retro gamers, I am the Killer Gamer and we are here with the Mattel Electronics and Television or Intelligent Television and we're going to be playing Tron Deadly Discs. This happens to be a pretty popular game for those uh, who enjoyed the Intellivision uh, back in the day. When I've looked up uh, favorite games that people have had of the Intellivision, this one was listed. Uh, in some cases, it was listed on the top. So, let's go ahead and try this out. Although mine's sh shooting and I don't want it to. <laughs> Oh, I almost got that one. I am not running very fast. What's happening? Look at that. He's not running fast. There he goes. A little bit of a glitch. Not fair. Oh, look at that. Oh, my word. Oh, I got two of them at the same time. That was pretty cool. bit better on this one. The controls are not the greatest. my blocking
Yeah. <laughs> Got two more. The AI is not exactly the smartest. Why is it... Like, why isn't it shooting at me when it's got a clear shot? They shoot like stormtroopers. wasn't even trying to shoot on that one. Just barely missed him. Dang it. Just stay in one place. <laughs> They got me. Okay. <laughs> All right, folks. That is Tron Deadly Discs. That's yeah, a little fun. Uh, need to try to map the controls a little better, at least with this emulator here, the uh, Nostalgia emulator. Um, I have a different emulator, and it was working a little bit better with my hand control. I was using the keyboard on this one, uh, but for some reason, I couldn't record. I don't know why, but I couldn't uh, record uh, the game. It would just record a freeze frame of it instead. So kind of weird, but, you know, the whole point is us getting uh, some type of uh, recording going. And, and so we did. And I want to thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this look back at Tron Deadly Discs. And we'll see you next time on another retro game. Have a killer awesome day.